Hi everyone, my name is Reeti Falfair and I am co-founder of Wise Champs Education which is on, into online education for kids and today we have a very special guest and very lovely girl Jisha Sikka. Hi. Hi Jisha. So uh, Jisha is currently in grade 5 and last year in grade 4 she appeared for Olympiad exams and she took Olympiad English and Maths, right? Yes. And so Jisha, what did you score? So in English I scored 40 on 40 as an international rank of 1. Awesome. And in math I scored 36 on 40. And what does that give you? That gives me uh, international rank 2. And with a gold medal, right? Yes. Awesome. So how do you feel? I feel excited, happy and proud of myself. And where is that excitement? Give me a high five. <laughs> so Jisha, uh, so what did it take to come across and prepare so well for it? It took a lot of practice and it took a lot of like it took time, practice and also it took like motivation. Right. Because for for appearing in Olympiad we have to practice first to score a high like to score well. Okay. And who guided you? My parents and they guided me and also they helped me a lot through my journey of practicing and preparing okay. for the And for how long did you practice? It was, I started in October 2021 and since the exam was in December 2020. Okay. So, so it was around, two to three months. Right, two to three months. Okay. And did you take like a lot of test, pre pre test practice, mock tests or worksheets? Um, I did. I had the Olympiad SOF uh, prep workbook okay. and in that I had the sample tests and sample questions and I took online mock tests on the SOF website. Okay. And did you, t it, was it all timed? Uh, yes. In the online ones it was timed but in the physical one which I was doing I would, I would like to time myself so I would time myself and see how long it took me to solve a particular sheet. Okay. And uh, so so you said you use SOF books. Yes. Did you feel that you you probably wanted someone who could solve your doubts instantly? Um, maybe some expert guidance anywhere at, at any point of time? So I would have liked and uh, liked some actual expert to help me but Overall, when I was preparing, my parents did a very good job of explaining everything to me. Awesome. And did it ever clash with the syllabus or your school studies that you have? No, because um, I got separate time for the Olympiad practice and the schoolwork. So most of the time, I would practice for the Olympiad on the weekends and then I would finish my schoolwork on the weekdays. Okay. And what are your goals? Like, did you like taking it? Did you did you ever find it mind-boggling? I never found it mind-boggling, and I found it really nice for me to challenge all my things that I have learned so far. And my short-term goal is that to appear in the uh, Olympiads for uh, the next year. Yes. And every year. Yes, every. Year. And win a medal every year. Yes. Awesome. <laughs> I'll try my best. So Jisha, uh, finally would you like to say something to our audience and there are a lot of students watching you as well? Yes. So a few tips that I would like to share would be that first of all practice is key and you should practice until you get your goals and achieve them. So great to have you Jisha and we are very very proud of you. I'm sure your parents are very proud of you and the audience who is speaking to you, looking at you right now is also very proud of you. And we wish you good luck for all the, ex all, all the competition exams that you Thank take. Thank you.